I have some tea, tea, tea. What is up, ATV gang? I am back. I am back. I am back. I know you guys probably missed me. I definitely missed you guys. Um, I definitely want to shout out to you guys. Staying loyal. You know, life has really hit. Um, so I got some tea for you guys today. I have some tea, tea, tea. I have some tea. And I just wanted to come on here and kind of give you guys kind of like a little life update why I've been inactive, why I've been MIA. I was sitting in my vlog, well, <laughs> what? I was sitting in my bed editing my moving vlog and I was like, there was a gap. Like there's literally been like probably like a month, a little bit over a month that I haven't been posting. I've been inactive, MIA, living under a rock and I wanna tell you guys why. I'm gonna keep it a buck with you guys. I literally haven't been posting for the sole reason, for the sole reason that I've been studying. I've been a great student, a great grad student. Guys, grad student life hit. So basically I've just been inactive because since probably like July, I wanna say, I've been studying for the two comprehensive exams that I told you guys about. If you watched my Q&A video that I did a couple months ago, um, I kinda talked about my grad program. I'm in the economics program. It's a three semester program. Um, we start, I started around this time, actually last fall, this spring, and this is the last semester. Um, however, before you graduate, you have to take two comprehensive exams. Not one, two. Got to take one for micro and you got to take one for macro so we had the macro one on tuesday and then we actually just had the micro one today and i really was like putting off everything but studying for my exam so social media what else do i do really i don't even know what else hanging out with people like i was i was really i had like the entire summer i basically had like a cloud like you see this cloud I had a cloud of micro and macro, like two clouds above my head. I was always guilty. Like I felt like I needed to be studying and like if I wanted to do stuff. So I would, you know, when I was home, I would like wake up early, try to study, you know, take a little break between the day, work out or whatever. And then like before I go to bed, try to study again. And then as um, soon as I came back and when school actually started, um, it was real. Like it was real. The entire month of July, and like, not entire month, probably like after July 4th and like between then and like, I guess August 25th or the exam was what? The first exam was the 30th. So between then I was kind of like really, really like studying and um, just like drilling it, drilling it, drilling it. Let me show you guys. I was actually a good little student and I had like, I had a folder for each subject. I had a folder for macro and a folder for micro. So I had two folders and I literally, and I had this huge whiteboard that I actually put away because I was taking up space in my room. But fun fact, when I moved into my apartment, probably like the first week, um, somebody had left a whiteboard in the hallway and they wrote, they wrote free on it. And I was like, clutch. So whoever that was, in this apartment, if you see this video, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you from the bottom of my heart. Because that board came in clutch. Like I had ordered this board, you know, it had like this side and then obviously for like, you know, organizational reasons, I ordered that type of board. And it was small. I mean, it, it served its purpose on my desk, but like the board that I had, I'm gonna have to insert like a clip like right here just for you guys to kind of get a gauge, it was like huge. So like I would be like studying like this and then like I would grab my little, my little expo marker and I'll be like writing and like studying and like writing and all that. 
And I, I just want to say, like, to whoever left that board out there, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Like, you don't even know how much you helped me. Like, you don't even know how much you helped me. But, yeah, I was actually a pretty good student. Um, I might make a video about my little study tips that I used to prepare. Or, like, a TikTok, probably, because it's, like, 15 seconds. It's quicker. But, basically, I'm, like, a, like, I have to write it down type of learner. Like, write it down, write it down, write it down. I also made, like, Quizlet. Uh, for like vocab and stuff but like problems and things like that like math like which is like economics or whatever so I, like graphs and all that just like repetition of writing it down writing it down so I felt like that kind of like helped me during these exams or like when I would see something that I like recognize like it would just click because like I just like would always writing and writing so this is a little bit of my little study tips um another study tip I hope you see the tv behind me I People, some people like, I don't know what you guys do, like comment down below, like what you guys listen to when you study, but I've come to terms that like, I can't listen to Drake when I play, like when I study. I cannot listen to Drake when I study because like, I'll be in my bag, my feelings, like anything, any type of emotion that like can come to me from a Drake song, I will be in that and like, I'll be studying, but like singing, studying and singing. And then now I'm not singing it. Now I'm not studying anymore. I'm just singing. So I started listening to classical music. I actually started doing this probably in high school where I had like a station. It was like on Pandora and it would be like classical music for studying. But then I just got onto YouTube and I would have like the one like just every like classical music just like playing in the background. So it really helped me like lock in. So definitely comment down below like what your guys' um, study tips are. But yeah, I don't want to keep you guys too long. I kind of just wanted to give you guys a nice life update. It is September 1st right now. I'm going to post this by the end of this weekend because I'm back. I want to be more consistent. I am going to prioritize everything. I also have this monthly planner that I got from Amazon. This is not an ad, but I mean, if it looks like an ad to you, then make it an ad. But it's a monthly planner from 2022 to 2024. So we're going to see how long this really lasts. But um, definitely got, I guess, since it's September 1st, I already started putting stuff in my September cal calendar. But I'm going to be very productive. I'm going to make sure to prioritize. I'm in two classes actually this semester. Um, I have like an internship and then I'm in two classes of R class, which is like really cool. It's like coding and stuff. And I want to get into that. So I like it so far. It's hard. It's tricky, but you know, it's going to be very much beneficial in the long run. And then I'm also taking this research class. So, you know, I'm just finishing up my degree um, last semester. I'm excited. Um, definitely want to get into more things. Like I said, I want to be more consistent social media wise, um, doing things. I have so many videos on my phone, actually, that um, need to be edited and all that. So soon come. Guys, you have to bear with me. I actually wanted to say thank you, thank you, thank you to everyone who supported me thus far. I have like 400 subscribers and I mean, for me, that's a lot. It was around this time last year where I was still kind of iffy about my channel. Um, I had like a lot of videos, like my Puerto Rico videos that I had, I was posting them kind of, I think around this time maybe, um, fact check me. But I took them in the summer and I was like, okay, I'm just gonna record all these videos and like, if I want to post them, I want to post them. And I felt like for me, what kind of gave me like the push was because like, I always like in my Snapchat, like my memories and stuff, I always have videos of me, you know, be a content creator, everything like that. So, you know, it was around this time that I was kind of like finding the confidence to really just say like, F it and like, you know, let's do it. So I did, God did, but, <laughs> but, um, as I was saying, thank you, thank you, thank you to everyone who is subscribed to my channel, everyone who's not subscribed and is watching right now, hit that subscribe button. Like, you're gonna be in for a ride. I just wanna say, I do love you guys because you guys kinda give me confidence even if you don't know, cause it, like, to me it shows, okay, like, people are watching, like, people are interested and, in, you know, everyone that's been here from the first video and even everyone that's been here because of this video or even my shorts, like, welcome to my channel. I hope you guys stay for a while. I definitely appreciate 400 right now. Let's keep going, right? Like, let's keep going. Tell a friend, tell a friend. <sighs> I mean, that's really it as for life updates. Oh, well, obviously I'm in my new apartment. 
and I haven't actually like my room is so empty right now like the walls there's nothing like obviously you see you know I'm at the desk and stuff and TV stuff but like no decorations none of that um that's another thing I kind of put off um we haven't had our apartment warming yet we moved in probably like a month ago a month and a half you guys haven't even seen the moving video so who knows but we moved in we are loving it and it's been great but like I said because I focus so much on my comprehensive exams um I really put off everything so I'm back I'm locked in I got my calendar right here I'm gonna start scheduling stuff um and yeah also you know I'm um, send me some inspo like some decoration inspo and all that because like I want this to be really homey um, I kind of have a vision for it. Uh, it's pretty homey now, but you know, I got to add some character, some flavor, some ATV sauce to it. But, um, ooh, I should make some ATV sauce once I learn how to cook though. But yeah, like I said, I don't want to keep you guys too long. I don't want to keep this video too long. I just want it to come out here and kind of just give you guys a little life update. Life is good. Um, I guess I'm in a well, and now after that exam, I'm in a way more positive mood. Um, I feel better. Like I just felt like the entire summer, like I said, I had that great cloud, but blue skies, clear skies, everything. Like you see my thumbnail, if you just like scroll up a little bit, look at my little, um, not even my thumbnail. You see my like, the background on my channel. You see the blue skies, that's what it's like. It just feels very nice. I'm relaxed. Um, yeah, man, I'm just very excited. I just feel like a weight has been lifted off my chest. Grad school is just not for the week. So anyone, all my grad students on here, they are going through it right now. I see the light at the end of the tunnel for you and for me. We about to be on the top, tippy top. So, you know, stay on your grind, stay focused. Um, and you know, anyone too, like y'all, y'all, shout out to everyone that's starting classes, getting any type of degree, no like, that, that shit is hard, like at any level, like it is hard. And you know, I was definitely in the trenches at some points, like, you know, I don't know how this exam is gonna go and I still don't know, but I definitely felt good about it because I felt like I prepared myself the best way I possibly could going into it. And I walked out with no regrets, no, like, you know, like I just feel good, blessed, I'm alive, I'm healthy. You know, everything is going well. And I hope the same is going well for you guys too. So like I said, thank you guys for, you know, being patient with me. Um, a lot of my friends, family, um, everyone that's on here that literally I have like, I literally like told my mom, I was like, I have to cut the world off for at least, like during, on Monday, I was like, I have to cut the world off for this week because I need to lock in. My phone was on DND like the entire time. And if you know me, you know that like, I never really update my phone. So I updated my phone and like now the DND is like, like you can send text messages quietly. You can like literally like make your phone so on do not disturb that you will like never get a notification. And I realized that because I was actually like missing calls from people and texts and all that. And I was like, I literally will be like on my phone and like not see anything. So I appreciate everyone. I know I had some, you know, some little, like I had mood swings. Like I was like low key, like had anxiety. Like during the test, I felt like I was gonna get a bloody nose because of why, right? Like I've never had a bloody nose in my life. And for some reason, I felt like that moment, I was gonna get a bloody nose, but that's TMI. But yeah, all I wanna say is, you know, keep grinding. It's a new month, new opportunities, new blessings, um, new open doors are gonna, open up for you guys um i hope everyone's doing well very excited for i guess like this new this new page like it's a new month it's a new page and it's a new focus you know i was focused on my comprehensive exams for basically the last two months of summer and now that that's over with that's behind me now i can turn the page and focus on creating content for you guys and creating content for myself and um the road to graduation Guys, I've been in college for seven years. Fact check me. But I've been in college for too long. And nothing's wrong with that. Um, I just feel like I'm, you know, ready to, you know, get my degree as I should. And, you know, see what's out for me in the big world. I'm excited for that. Um, and yeah, I'm gonna have myself a nice little fall, a good fall semester um, as a college student. And then, you know, Onto big things, big things, big things. But like I said, guys, 
Um, oh, look at this gem. It says, the past has no power over the present moment. Y'all, shout out to Eckhart Tolle. I'm going to repeat that again. The past has no power over the present moment. Y'all, let go and let God be where your feet are. Like, you are here. Be proud of the person you are now. Like, I didn't come on here to spit ATV gems, but I'm going to give you guys ATV gems always. So, like I said, I appreciate you guys for tuning in. Like, comment, subscribe if you want to. Phone a friend. Let a friend know. Let a cousin know. Sister, brother, mother, aunt, grandfather, grandfather, cousin, second cousin, third cousin, and the fourth cousin. Let them know. ATV gang is now accepted members. So become a part of the gang. Hit that subscribe button. Comment down below. Thank you guys for tuning in. And until my next video, peace out.